hello, Medi K here, and we're back for another King Hearts Chain of Memories video. Last episode, honestly can't remember. I need to start recording on a constant basis. I keep forgetting what I. Yeah, keep forgetting. And then just... yeah. I really need to start recording more consistently. <laughs> Honestly, where am I actually going right now? Because I don't have a clue. At the point I'm just running around, hoping I can figure that out. Up here we go. Maybe not. Okay, there we go, and there we go. Look like this is as far as we can go. God, just turn down the volume quite loud on my ears. <laughs> anyway. Ready then. Let's check things up. Did I read that right? I don't know. My English is terrible. It's my first language, but yeah, I'm terrible. Anyway, it would be easier if we had someone... Perfect tone, looks like we've got company. But they just showed up, like, you didn't even see them and then they showed up. So how did we have company at that point in time? Defeat the Heartless to fill out the gauge. Gauge? 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 It's a different gauge, ain't it? Man, my English is terrible! within the time limit. Be careful, the gauge will decrease with Okay. Probably wait for that potion here. Go JP! Goofy! Goofy! That's it for the gauge. It's yes, very good. Yay! That was easy. Oh, and um. I guess I'm gonna boost the CP, I guess. Phew! Hayak? Is it... what? Ayuk? Ayuk? <laughs> That's definitely... That's definitely English. It's working! Monstro's gonna sneeze! So we're out east. I thought we were out east. Ow, oh, now I know what getting shot out of cannon feels like. Where's Pinocchio and his dad? They're gone. They must have gone out safely. Without you, Jiminy, I thought there was no escaping your conscience. I don't mind being left behind as long as they're both safe. Maybe Pinocchio doesn't need me after all. What do you mean? That little puppet used to have trouble telling right from wrong. 
but he's come a long way. Maybe he doesn't need to give any cricket anymore. Seems like he's got a conscience of his very own. Do you remember what Gepetto said? There's something better than being really nice with someone you care about. I bet Pinocchio's counting on the days to continue again. Well, what do you know? You might be right. Done. I guess we just leave. Yeah. Oh, the bitch at the exit, right up here. And the save point, because I'm afraid I'm gonna need to save us. And and story as well. Story will be happening. Mm, just bits and pieces. Maybe you could try telling us some more stuff about her. Who knows? It might even help you remember other things. Well, uh... She was quiet and always drawing. When we'd go to the beach, She'd draw a picture instead of swimming. Sometimes she'd draw us, too. She was really good. <laughs> I remember Riku and I fighting over who she'd draw next. But one day, she was gone, just like that. I think the grown-ups knew the reason. They might even I've tried to explain some of it to me. But I was little. I probably didn't understand what was happening. I remember crying after she was gone. But that's all. I still don't remember her name. Oh, I bet you'll remember it in no time. Ah, I must point out, Sora keeps remembering things instead of forgetting them. It seems to me, forgetting things may be the only way to reach the memories buried deeper down inside each of us. So we should forget in order to remember? Like those guys said, our most precious memories lie so deep in our hearts that they're out of reach. All that stuff about finding, being losing, and losing being finding? I didn't get it at first, but maybe this is what they meant. Gore, Sora, I think I'm a little jealous of you. How come me and Donald and Jiminy aren't remembering more of the stuff from our memories? Come on, Goofy! Let's get going! We gotta forget things faster! Sounds like, sounds like this place is just alcohol. Drink enough, you forget everything. Huh. So I'm guessing that huh. backstory of Edge <laughs> new nominee beforehand. Just as we intended. We'll continue with our plan. Let's see how far this group will go. You had your fun on the first floor. So this time, it's my turn. <laughs> I'm not going to just give it to him. Don't break him. Well, do I detect a soft spot? I'm not going to break the toy. I'm not dumb. Don't forget. 
Sora is the key. We need him if we're going to take over the organization. I know that you're in on it too. But keep it under your hood. At least until the time is right. <laughs> you would have been wise to have done the same, Larkseen. So, Sora, did anything back there help you remember your friend's name? Uh... Her name's the only thing I can't seem to remember. You gotta try! How do you have to remember it? <laughs> It's like they're trying to take over the organization. But they're already a part of. Uh, there's only one place we can go. Gosh, don't like the looks of this place. A bit of crawling with ghosts. You're probably right there, but anyway, we'll see. Ah, ah, Pooey, there's nothing to be worried about. As there's just a scream in the background. I'm not sure you guys heard that, but I definitely heard that. You won't be spooked if you already know what's coming. Really? Is that how it works? If you're going to the haunted house, you'd expect to be haunted. But you're still scared anyway. Well, I mean, some people have nerves to steal, but yeah. I don't real guys can frighten us anymore. If they take one look at us, they'll be the ones to run away. Uh, I guess. You really think so? Trust me, I didn't read that by the way, so I thought I would. Welcome to Halloween Town! Ah, uh, we uh, remember to trust you, right? Not to be scared? Ah, a ghost. Wow, that was the biggest shriek I've heard in ages. If you're that easy to scare, we're gonna have a great time. Sorry, I haven't even introduced myself. I'm Jack Skellington, and this is Halloween Town. People around here call me the Pumpkin King. Of ghost. Ego reference. Haha. <laughs> so, if you're looking for a ghoulish good time, you can't tell I probably botched that, but oh well. Well, we aren't. As if that's like jumping. Looks like he's celebrating. Too bad because at the moment we've got a bit of a problem in Halloween Town. What's the kind of problem? Well, like this. Ah, uh, yay, heartless. Yay, my favourite. I keep complaining about this, even though it's a point in the game to take them out. I see, I fight me with game logic, I doubt it, but I should just not question it. Colonel. I did a go of it. But a lot of things don't make sense, but anyway. Fire! Oh, 
war die Dash für dich, wenn ich das hier. Donald's are celebrating again. What's the big idea? Why are you go and call the Heartless? Do you think he called them here? Really? You see, we're having a problem. And then... And then die over the problem. So why would he call them here, Donald? Again, why am I questioning this? I didn't call them, I just said when they're gonna show up. In fact, I would love to get rid of them. They actually go around taking people instead of just scaring them. Why are they here? I was just gonna ask Dr. Finkelson the same question. I'm heading to his laboratory right now, follow me. Sorry, what should we do? I guess we better go. I don't like this. Why are leading us right to the heartless? <laughs> I was not expecting to see that. It didn't scare me, but it was just like, whoa, that's a close up there, right there. Bingo, you, you saw right through me. Ha <laughs> ha I'm just kidding. Now let's go. <laughs> Sora learns terror. Hey, I should really add some stuff in here. Hit the instant time pose. Yes, yes, yes. Get in my face. Uh, it's more heartless for shot now. What's so strong? Fire! All I want to do is just take that down. It's so hard. Because apparently it is. Yeah, I got, I 
I don't like the flower pack, it's so annoying. Fire! Oh, oh. Wrong one! Yeah. I want the potion. Or oh, the heal. As I found the heal myself. So many heartless, like, come on. Yeah. I wouldn't mind it if it was like yeah. not this game. Yeah. So this game is like sort of annoying. Fire. You can't touch the sword of it. Yeah. You gotta use the card. You gotta use the heart of the card, people. Yeah. You go reference number two. As I'm gonna pick up the skeleton in front. <laughs> skeleton, it's a pumpkin. Wow. Go, <laughs> GP. Well, it's just a really strong card, it's annoying. Yeah, yeah. Fire. Burn. Yeah. See you later. Now, the next thing is, which way do I go? This is fun, why not? Yeah. yeah you meant to hit him, not the um, Yeah. Um whatever that was. Yeah. I say I actually don't know what I hit. I know I just didn't hit that. I hit it like a tombstone. Yeah. This is way better. I should have more of those weak ones. And that reminds me I got more sleep. Yeah. Pumpkin! I swear the here. Yeah. But oh, bang! Yeah. Did you hit it? Yeah. Yeah. Freeze. How am I getting long? I can't stop your cars. Yeah. Yeah. Don't I? That's making it so annoying. Wow. Fire! Even waking these cards are so annoying. So it's done, possibly, if there wasn't so many colors. Yeah! As, where do I go now? Is this a dead end? Yeah! Ah, I see. I see. As I can hit this as well. Yeah. I just want to get yeah. to the next part of the story, then I'm going to end the episode, guys. Freeze. This has been a very decent episode so far. Really? Go down! Please. Let's do that. Heal. Yeah. See you later. You're done. You're done now. Yeah. Big shot. Go, please. As I failed to hit the heartless. Yeah. 
Yeah. <laughs> As I like to say, I like to hit the yeah. ear. Ha. Get a lot of ear time. Yeah. Yeah. If only I was good at basketball. Deal. Freeze. Fire. Allow me to introduce Dr. Finkelson, who's a real famous genius. Yes, maybe I'm too smart. I'm afraid I've created something horrible. What's that? Uh, have you ever thought to think about the power of true memories? True memories? You see my voice, our hearts are full of memories. But not all of them reflect the truth. The heart is a recording voice. Even poor memories change with time. They warp or fade, leaving us with a shadow of what we hope to remember. Could that be happening to me? I have a survey fun. Some memories grow ugly and some become more beautiful. If we can remember our true memories, our world would be seen would seem completely different. I'm barely making it through to speaking perfect English, or, it, or decent English. So I devised a potion from forget-me-nots that brings back our dream memories back. I'm pretty sure I read that wrong, but oh well. Did it work? Question mark, question mark. Well, that's the problem. As soon as the dot look got a whiff of the potion, Heartless started popping out. Sounds like a failed experiment to me. No, my research is flawless. That's how he gets voice. I just need another look at the potion to find out where I went wrong. I read that wrong. But I'm gonna keep talking like this now. I'm just looking at this and it seriously can't be good for his brain. Unfortunately, it finished. Maybe someone swiped it. Maybe Swiper? Dora? The Spore, anyone? <laughs> wow. Man, I'm making Yugo reference and now a Dora the Spore reference. It must have been Sally. Jack, you gotta find her and get my potion back. Leave it to me. Can I take along? It's like giving the same voice to everyone now. What for? I want to know more about these true memories the doctor keeps talking about. Excellent, then let's go find Sally. I was literally about to say something then I had to hold myself back because that's not exactly PG. I'm just gonna head back because I'm gonna save it there guys. Yeah, it chose the right way. See, so I hope you enjoyed the episode, guys. Make sure you leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more. This is Medicaid, and I'm out.